Hey Stargazers, Arik and Philip here and just, you know, there's so much going on and we've been doing surrogate healings for people. So I uh, just wanted to do a little balancing to show um, how you can, you know, just reduce some of the fear because actually fear will uh, decrease the immune system. It'll, it'll weaken the immune system. and. Uh, actually, I just did a whole balance around immune system and antibiotics and whatnot. So, um, I think it's really important to, to kind of understand these things. So, anyhow, quarantine version. Um, we're going <laughs> to jump into this. I think you had some phlegm that we wanted to help kind of uh, just disintegrate. So, we're just doing an astrology balancing. Hold. Okay, so let's just check. Health is good. Health is good. Perfect. So Libra, actually this is the full moon of Libra, so you're probably really feeling this. Mm -hmm. Maybe I should do a full moon balancing on you. Okay. Uh, because actually you said that you weren't even sleeping that well last night. because I, I woke up thousands of times. Mm -hmm. So we're in the full moon window. So maybe I'm just going to do uh, a full moon balance. Okay, yeah, so you're a Libra. You have full moon in Li we're having the full moon in Libra. Uh, your rising sign Sagittarius. Um, let me just see here. Okay, so just hold that. Good. Good. Okay. So Libra is connected to the archetype Justice, which is a tarot archetype. And actually this full moon is connected to the Three of Swords. So this is for you what's going on. Mm -hmm. So I think it's about healing still like some past heartbreak let me just see it in regards so you have you have like what's called a like an allergic reaction to this archetype so i'm just going to help you with that let's see okay so let's see so this could be like with past relationships or um, family members, mostly it's about relationships and trust and um, you know it's also opening the heart as well. Mm -hmm. okay. okay, so we have a question coming up. So these, you know, taking care of yourself, wellness, all kinds of things, it all helps with immunity because, I mean, that's what we're facing as a collective. We need to open our hearts more. We need to get, you know, more intact and aligned with what it is that's how we're really feeling. You know, cha transforming hatred into to love. So, is that okay? Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay. How do I know the limits of my capacity to love and what did I need to do to differently to have new experiences? Good. Oh. Okay, so your center is off kilter. So I'm just going to... So this is really in all, all in relation to this Three of Swords energy. And I mean, this is kind of how the world feels right now, right? I mean, with this full moon, everyone's like heartbroken. They're missing their lives. So Libra is justice. It balances the scales. Mm -hmm. that, but we were just talking about that, actually. It's like, yeah, there's a lot of healing and all the factories are shutting down. You can see the fish and, you know, there's, there's a lot of nature is, is getting its power back. But it could have happened without so many casualties, mm -hmm. you know? But like we're just always going, 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 going until bam. So, OK. 
Okay. Perfect. Okay. Okay, so how do I know the limits of my capacity to love? And what did I need to do differently to have new experiences? Good. So it's all about love. So this is a question you can contemplate, particularly for you, especially during this full moon in, in Libra, which is the Libra. And also this full moon is the full moon of war. So that means that all the spiritual wars that you will face in the next astrological year, the outcome will be determined by this full moon. So what I mean by spiritual war is like the inner struggles to always become the better version of yourself. Mm -hmm. You know, like, okay, am I going to be lazy? Or am I going to be entitled? Or am I going to talk gossip? Or am I going to, you know, all these different things. For all of us, we are going to see how are we going to overcome them. Mm -hmm. So, yep. And when we lose our wars, then that happens. <laughs> so we all want to really do our job. Um, of course, I'm having my full moon online event that you can sign up for. I do them every month. New moon, full moon, and the, su and the sun meditations. Okay, now what's coming up is rose quartz. Some rose quartz healing. Gonna have to disinfect this afterwards. Okay, so we're gonna do some rose quartz healing. And let's just check and see. Okay, so. Actually, while I'm at it. Okay. Interesting. So Libra is connected to the air element, of course. So we're purifying the air energy. Hello. <laughs> this. Energy's moving quickly. So this is uh, energy connected to Venus, which is the ruler of Libra. Good. Good. Okay, so now, what is this doing? That's good, okay. Okay, so this again. Okay, so now what's coming up is Scorpio energy. So Scorpio is the energy connected to uh, the death archetype. It has to do with release, letting go, so that you can make room for something new. And then when you have, so what happens is when you let go of something, you create a space. But then you need to put good energy in that space because otherwise negative energy can creep in. So. Let's just see in regards to that. Okay, that's okay. Let's see. Good. Okay. Good. So we just need to make sure that it's working in combination here. Okay, so now one of my other healing crystals is coming up. So we're gonna use one of these. Where does it want to go? Okay, it's going to go down by the feet. 
So now we just let that set. We have like a nice mandala going here of archetypes and crystals. Let's see. Okay, now we need to use some of this uh, double happiness essential oil. Double happiness is for happiness in relationships and just within yourself. So I'm going to give you let's see, two drops. Rub your hands together. Inhale through your mask. Smell it. I can smell it. <laughs> yeah? Mm -hmm. OK, good. OK, so now while that mandala is setting in, I'm just going to check in with the phlegm. OK. Oh, you also need an essential oil for that. Respiratory system. Respiratory system will help you to expel it. Mm -hmm. So you can rub it on here. And then also, I have a vitamin called uh, lung, which is really good for the lungs. Mm -hmm. um, if, you know, you can take some of that. Mm -hmm. Let me see, and what else do I have? Okay, there's something else you need. Something I need to do. Oh. Okay. Mm. Okay, let me see. Okay, I'm just going to stimulate the lung points. So I'm doing two simultaneous balancings at once. Beautiful. Wonderful. Okay. And let's see how this is going. Looks good in relation to the Fulmin of Libra. Okay. Perfect. So this is just a quick demo without having to go into all of it. So all of this is good. Perfect. Health is good. Health is good. Okay. All right, so that was just a quick balancing to demonstrate, you know, cultivating more love and healing and positive energy because we all have to do it um, ourselves so that we can, you know, make a difference in the world. So this, I, you know, this brings healing just by watching it. Uh, please send it to anybody you think it might help. And if you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below. And I'm here if you want to book a session with me. We'll do a long distance. We basically fill up then serves as your surrogate. And then we can send healing out to anybody anywhere on just about almost anything. So thank you very much. And please stay safe and take care. Bye.